Good morning, Miss Paisley. Say good morning, everybody. Good morning. So for breakfast, we're starting off with a half a cup of quick oats. I have half a banana. I have a couple of strawberries, blueberries, mango, and chia seeds. All of the fruit on top here is frozen except the banana. But when you mix this up with the hot oatmeal, all of the fruit starts to get to room temperature and it actually breaks down in the oatmeal really, really nicely. So you get that really good fruity flavor. I also added half a scoop of vegan vanilla protein powder, the one that I showed you in one of my previous videos. Let's get the day started. Hey guys, couple things I wanna show you that I purchased. Um, it's random, some of it's BJ's, some of it's Walmart, but I did go ahead and get myself one of these potato mashers. Oh, did I want one of these. La la, a giant cutting board. Look at this one. Look how thick it is. This way, I don't have to keep using this little one. It's just too small. So I got a nice big one to set myself up for success. It was $29.99. Actually, this thing was like $4 and change. Uh, then I went to BJ's because I had a coupon for $2 off. Look at the size of these Medjool dates. See that? It came out to $5 and, oh my God, don't kill me, 49 cents for this big tub. It's like half the size of my head. It is two pounds. You cannot beat it. There's a coupon. You can get it inside the store or if you have a BJ's, uh, the, that little flyer that comes in the mail, the coupon is in there. Run because these are so good. At BJ's, I found, look how cute this is. Let me move it out of the way. Look at this sweatshirt. I got it in an extra large because then I could wear, you know, a t-shirt, something underneath it. I thought it'd be great for the gym. I figured I would try it on for you. Let me just move the camera down. Let me show you, hold on. How cute, right? It's got the kangaroo pouch. So you can put your phone in there and yeah, I just think it's really nice. It's nice and long, loose. So I like it kind of up more. So yeah, what do you guys think? Cute, right? All right, I'm gonna go to the gym. I will see you later. All right, here's lunch. It is the sweet potato that I cooked the other night. And as you can see, I used my Uba plate here, half starch, half veggie. I'm gonna lift up these little zucchini rounds and show you that half of my spinach is cooked and wilted. It just was steamed in the microwave. And half is fresh. And then I have some zucchini. It's nighttime. I'm going to the gym. I just had a pre-workout shake that you just saw. Or maybe you didn't see it. I think I put it on Instagram. But either way, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll be able to see my pre-workout shake that I've been doing. And it gives so much energy. And I am going to go kick ass. So we'll see you at the gym. Any hours later. All right, it's actually the next day. I'm going to be making a really hearty, hearty meal here. This is baby Bella mushrooms that I'm cutting up and then I'm going to take a half of a yellow onion and I'm gonna use water instead of oil to saute it. It works out very well and we don't get the unnecessary calories that oil has. So mushrooms and onions together. In the meantime here, I'm gonna do my starch, which is russet potatoes. I'm not eating all of these, but I'm making extra so that Brittany or Jess can have some later. But these are gonna be steak fries. I am gonna cook them in my air fryer with a little bit of nutritional yeast, and that's it. So here's the pot so far, and I'm going to be taking some unsweetened almond milk and about a half a teaspoon of just white flour, mixing it into a roux. It'll make the most creamy sauce. Then I'm gonna add my seasonings. So we have some oregano, and then I added some nutmeg. This is getting good, guys. This red pepper jar has uh, vinegar as its base, so I'm gonna pour a little bit of that in for some tang, little bit of yellow mustard 
and then I'm gonna start stirring it up. Now, I'm gonna add a protein source. What do you think it's gonna be? Can anyone guess? There you go, shelled edamame from Trader Joe's. I put in a bunch of that, stir it up, and I'm gonna show you my plate. This took about 20 minutes in total. Here it is, doesn't that look amazing? So you see the potatoes, all I did was put the uh, air fryer on 400 degrees, cooked it for about 20 minutes, and the only thing on the potatoes is nutritional yeast. I'm now gonna top the potatoes with this mushroom edamame onion mixture, which is absolutely delicious. I will tell you, I could have eaten this the whole night. The other half of my plate is spinach and arugula, and I did top the veggies off with one heaping tablespoon of hummus. Woo, this meal. This is what the plate looks like. Again, half the plate is starch, more than half the plate is non-starchy veggies. I've got my protein, I've got my hummus, and I've got the potatoes. That is the mainstay of the meal. The potatoes will hit the satiety part of the brain and let me know that, wow, this was a nice filling meal. And boy was it, because I was full for hours and hours. So I do wanna show you what was left over. I cut up about four potatoes. Here's what's left. Again, they're just air fried with a little nutritional yeast on it. I'm gonna show it to you next to my plate of food. And this was my day, guys. Delicious.